Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. T-Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date, fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. Been waiting long? Mi madre always said patience pays off, so... So, Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Hijone. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Doubt shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast then? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. <sighs> Don't know you. Just open the fucking door. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Ah, cozy place. They could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a gel factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. I've been all over it. Maggots. Hey, what was in there? Militech truck. But those cabrones only swiped a couple crates. Not a whole fucking semi. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel's better. My favorite. Subtle. Royce, we got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You will deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0 D12, called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid Brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. 
I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. What gives? Primerito, I don't like this guy's tone. Segundo, sitting on your ass makes you an easy target. Sit your ass Jack, down for- sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on, got lighten up. Take a hit. What you blowing? Eskif, pure as baby powder. Black lace. Tough to get your hands on. Gotta have a good source. What's it do? Upstorfs an adrenaline to the point you feel no pain. Trip's so intense it verges on psychosis. Corps fed it to their fighting legions during the Corp Wars. Cyber psychos pop the tabs like candy. Vaporizing it mellows the burn without killing any of the effect. Come on, give it a whirl! Tech's not gonna come looking for it. Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift an access locks using our soft. Once it's yours, it's yours. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm. Could lose your lunch. So, what you think? We'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid out. Brick got it. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Fuck Brick then. Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Relax. Got him right here. Just like that! Without that in a fucking eye! <laughs> want it or not, I got places to be. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> Maybe he ain't dead? So, can you consider my offer now? <sighs> Creds on this. Hey, 
Flat Hat's good gear. It'll do the trick for you, whatever the trick is. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! Chip's got a vector! They're breaking in! Carol! I want heads! Here Grab the gear. Bot and control side. Quick! Got the set. Bot and controller. Then let's go. The quicker the better. Now let's get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. this beat. Ah, I could taste it. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. No other way. Oh, good. Let's move it. Let's go. Detonator. Armed. Thank you. 
Battle's over! Gate. 
talk there. Like a Militech bitch. Hmm. Bet you didn't expect to see me here. You know, I like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us. Be more than glad to. Till next time then, V. Corporate gods willing. Secure the area. Time we were on our way, mamita. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. I think we're done. That's it. Yeah. I had enough for one day. Let me tell you. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. El Fatso ought to crack open a bottle for us after what we did for him today. Ahí luego, V. How things looking, Miss V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure. Of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You used the corporal woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch for Maelstrom. One thing Stout forgot to mention. Chip was carrying a virus. Oldest corporal trick in the book. I assume Royce was less than understanding. Virus attacked their systems. Scorched a handful of maelstromers. I took care of the rest. You got some balls, Miss B. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Miss V.
que ya tengo planes para esta noche. Virgen Santísima, ma. Te vas a enterar mañana. Yo también te quiero, ma. About time, chica. What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. Whatever. Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! We have arrived. The Major Leagues. Does not get any higher, Chum. And you know something else? We fucking earned it, chica. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Really, Jackie? What? Told you that myself. Oh, for reals? Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, that must have been ages ago. And who might you clowns be? We're friends of Dexter Deshaun. He's expecting us. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. This is it. Part of Night City. That's it right there. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All sat on those stools. Fell asleep on that same bar. Hey, grab a seat. We'll be with you in a sec. Looks like we're up. Hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. Duo of Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. It's like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. How long's the afterlife been around? Half a century? Longer. Don't know by how much, though. Gotta be the oldest club in Night City. And the most respected. Don't forget that bit. Say I wanted to have a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind-blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. Stein's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Tonight, city. And the afterlife! <laughs> oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer, oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Deshaun, see you? you now. My job to know. Look around. How do you think Mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Dex a regular? You come here a lot? A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. 
didn't show his face for nearly two years. Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. Break a leg. Thanks. Damn, Holmes. You're huge. Work out? Mm. Same here. No, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? Mm. Think you could take me? Drop me? In here. Este pinche tipo. Right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies, as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Miss V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Well, let's see this bad boy. Alright then. Set your butts down comfy. Thanks for your help, back at the scav hunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Miss V. Evelyn Parker. How'd you fare? Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza, inside, from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target. Yorinobu Arasaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? I think she just wanted to see what I was about. Wanted to see what you was about, huh? How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. Adela Main will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. It goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. How do we get in the penthouse? Yorinobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Kompeki's dweller, elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Now hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hit you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more, what's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Hannah Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with Arasaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. 
Anything else? Transport to Delamain. Bremis Cab Company in All Night City. Not a mall. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The No-Tell Motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? Okay. Bill brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Cut for fresh talent's always the same and non-negotiable. 30%. Bro, 30? Every part in this drama carries its risks. That's the value of yours as determined by me. Jack, it's fine. Don't push it. Are you for real? Drop it, I said. Cut's fair. Trust me. Fine. Whatever. Fuck it. Last thing. Kempecki's got a strict no-iron policy. Security gates. The works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part, too. Gee, though. Thanks, T. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week, two tops is my guess. And what do we do while waiting? Sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, cause old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet. So don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta Two. Gotta prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues, now's your chance. You and Dex known each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, peeps say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophizing. No wonder you get along. Plan, what's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. I'm good. No questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. Just don't forget to suit up. anything? How's the afterlife? Working here, I mean. No real complaints. Fights are rare, and when they do happen, they're over quick. Killer clientele, am I right? Your words, not mine. Mrs. Booman, I hope? Seen it yourself. Can't complain. Folks always get thirsty, and we're here when they do. Thanks, Claire. No problem. Just holler if you need anything.
So, you ready? 